This video explains how to test for prime numbers using the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. In this video, I will show you an example. And for this example, we first need to create a vector of numbers, as you can see in line two of the code. So after running this line of code, a new data object called X is appearing at the top right. And we can print this data object to the bottom in the R Studio console by running line three of the code. And then you can see that our data object is a vector of four numbers, the numbers 2, 7, 10, and 70. Now let's assume that we want to check which of these numbers are prime numbers. Then we can use the functions of the MATLAB package. And for this, we first need to install and load the package, as you can see in lines 5 and 6 of the code. I have installed this package already, so for that reason, I'm just going to load it with line 6 of the code. And after running this line of code, we can use the isPrime function of the MATLAB package. And we can also use the isLogical function to convert our output to a logical vector. So if you run line 8 of the code, you can see at the bottom that another vector is returned, which contains four logical values. And in case this value is true, it tells us that the corresponding number, so in this case, the number 2, is a prime number. And in case the logical output is false, the corresponding number, so in this case 10, is not a prime number. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage, statisticsglobe.com, because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching, see you in the next video.